Hi everyone, it's Richard at Plum Dog here. So I've been asked to service a Rinai portable gas heater. So what we've got here is, this is a Rinai Avenger 25. Um, the heater's reported to be working fine. I just want to do some sort of proactive maintenance on it. So I'm just going to show you a few tips. If you've got this type of heater or, or a similar heater, there's a couple of things that you can do yourself. Uh, just to uh, just to keep on top of the maintenance on it. So let me show you what you can do. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe so you're notified each time we upload a video. I'm outside, just for maintenance purposes, and you can just see straight away that inside the uh, the grate there, it's collecting dust. And if we spin the heater around. also see that there's a couple of filters here this filter and this filter and it's just really like full of dust all right so as I said I've brought it outside because um, cleaning these up is uh, can be quite a messy job uh, but basically you can remove these two filters yourself you don't need to be a licensed plumber or gas fitter to, to remove those and you can just blow off the dust um, and just give it a general clean up. Uh, obviously as gas fitters, there's a, a few of the steps we need to take uh, to do a proper service, which we recommend doing every two years, uh, which is giving it a real good clean out inside and, and checking the, uh, the gas operation and safety switches and, and things like that. Um, but, um, but in regards to cleaning the filters, you can, you can definitely do that yourself. So I'll, um, I'll just remove the filters now and, and show you me cleaning them up. So it's easy if you lay it down. electric blower but you can use a vacuum cleaner it just does the same job this one blows vacuum sucks and just get your filter on if you get a dry paintbrush you can get all that dust out of there On both sides and give it a little blow. And you can actually rinse these through with cold water um, and just let them dry. It's um, it's like a plastic mesh just to get everything out. Um, sometimes you just use a cloth and some spray just to really get it out, clean all the plastic up. So that's that one.
Okay, there you go. So there's a gas heater all cleaned out. There's a couple of tests that I did sort of off camera. I uh, just tested the bayonet, was gas tight, tested the anti-tilt switch, checked the uh, safe operation of the heater and what have you. But I uh, just wanted to show you those few tips of cleaning the filters that you uh, can potentially sort of do yourself. Okay, thanks for watching guys. We'll catch you on the next video. Goodbye. Hey, where are you going?